Hi guys, my name is Nipuna. Today I'm going to show how to create terrain system in Houdini 17. Uh, it's the simplest and fastest way. So let's begin. Okay, so uh, I'm gonna add a height field, uh, HF height field node and uh, go inside and see all press F so and I'm gonna keep uh, it's like a size a thousand by thousand I'm gonna keep as it is so we'll let's add uh, HF noise yeah this one this uh, they have a new three noises so we can add the uh, first one so yeah so this one and it's it's look it's look something like this but we have some different noise types so we can change uh, with the noise type and yeah purling yeah something like this flat looking flat yeah so you can keep keep looking which one you like yeah this is just like more mountain and okay they have added uh, l more extra uh, noise types and this is this is we know already it's existing and this one as well and this is the new one it looks nice it's fine yeah something different something new yeah this one also nice yeah so I'm gonna choose something like uh, yeah like something like this so yeah, yeah this one something yeah mm, this look nice okay let's stick le okay let's do this one uh, okay I'm gonna keep s I'm not going to change a lot of settings keep as it is the center noise uh, I'm gonna reduce the amplitude okay I need a very low level uh, and element size uh, I'm gonna yeah I'm gonna make it bigger now so it's look nice yeah Ready, okay yeah, so these lines are straightforward so I just need to do something like uh, noisy I'm gonna add uh, HF this distort uh, by uh, by noise yeah so this one yeah see this now lines look more noisy it's look uh, yeah it's look nice it's look noisy and it's not straightforward uh, yeah, you, we can edit this, edit this element size. Uh, yeah, roughness. Increase a little bit roughness. It looks nice. It looks fine. Uh, I want to. I want to make amplitude a little bit like this. Okay, let's increase size of element size and amplitude a little bit more. Yeah, it looks nice. Yeah, yeah, it's getting more details okay so um, a little bit more so let's, yeah something like this that's amplitude little bit slightly yeah uh, it has some little height and it's not looking more flat so it's fine so i'm gonna add uh, let's add uh, what do you call this one HF I think uh, yeah HF this uh, erode yes this one so this one I'm gonna connect this here and yeah this is fine visualization I, I just I just want to remove the visualization and uh, I'm gonna add separately uh, another visualization HF visualize yes this one yeah, this look nice. Let's press compute range. Yeah, it's fine. It's look nice. Okay, I'm gonna uh, add another one. HF convert. Uh, yeah, this is convert. Uh, convert height field. Yeah. So I'm gonna add this one, and it's gonna convert as all all the details as a 3D model, and press uh, back point colors. Yeah, it's fine. Uh, right now, it's fine. So let's 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 do some uh, changes, color changes, something like this. Uh, okay, yeah, something like these colors. 
yes i just want to make something uh like more dry look some sand kind of that kind of feeling so i'm going to change this all colors something like this let's see yeah it's it's look nice change this one let's try something different color something blue color uh let's see how it's look like but anyway i have to change the range yeah this one yeah this 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 range we have to adjust i mean you can play with this range and you can come up with beautiful uh result change something like this 50 yeah actually uh let's let's change more 75 it's fine oh no actually let's do another way uh okay this has to be yeah something like this yeah yeah this this fine this something like this yeah you can play with all the values and everything yeah fine it's look okay so i want to add uh, i mean i'm going to change this timeline then you, we can get some kind of uh, simulation uh, calculation and the result it's going to take little time mm, let's see all right so we got some nice details it's look nice it looks fine but uh, i need to add more colors like uh, water debris debris and so and so so change the colors yeah something like this yeah we can change we can play with this all the colors and this one yeah it's look nice this color i like it let's change this one uh, i don't want blue color let's yeah something like this color mhm mm uh this black one mhm mm yes uh okay so uh, change this one as well yes change this one as then water color and change this one yeah that's fine this looks fine uh but you see over here the, the resolution is not looking nice it's uh kind of pixelated so i'm going to increase the resolution by uh decrease amount of uh, low 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 amount of uh, grid spacing uh it's going to be increasing uh, the resolution of the terrain details and everything so 0.45 something like that is fine and it's going to be like it's going to take time actually so as soon as long as you decrease these things it's going to take little longer time so let's see how it's going to be okay i'm going to press 25 and i'm going to fast forward my video so let's see all right so we got uh, nice details yeah it just look nice it's looking uh, beautiful 
so we got some yeah nice details and everything looks beautiful and yeah so over here still we can change some colors i mean this this colors changing and all the details changing uh, and completely if you want to change everything completely you can change so that's a that's a very good uh, in houdini not like any other softwares like see the over here is very noisy and all the patterns and everything that's look amazing okay let's see yeah this this look this look nice so that's that's the best uh, that's a really good thing in houdini you can do anything okay if i uh, let's see if I want to change this all everything into different style I can change from nice to something like this one yeah something like this let's change this one yeah yeah uh, I think I have to recalculate everything yeah so again we had to recalculate everything go back to the zero it's gonna take little time okay and I will press again yeah all right here we go it's look really beautiful uh, it's amazing it's look perfect right now yes yeah, beautiful mountain and terrain system that's it's it's really beautiful actually what I did over here amplitude I have play with these two uh, values like amplitude and element size and uh, I got like this kind of result so yeah you you can you guys can change anything uh, like like this all the values and you can test it out uh, and you can get the result as you want so this is the this is the beauty of this Houdini that you can do uh, like a redo all like for example if the client want to do some something completely change so if you do it with any other software so you have to do from the beginning everything so in in houdini uh if you want to do some quick change or do some major change of your uh, project still you can do it because this all are not based and the procedural system yeah it's it's look nice so we use only few nodes over here right now we didn't do anything complicated stuff it's really simple and elegant so this look really nice this is perfect so all right so just uh, subscribe my channel youtube channel uh, and i'm gonna do more more and more, more videos about houdini uh, with uh, mountains and more simulations and lot of a uh, lot of Houdini stuff I'm gonna create more videos so please subscribe my uh, YouTube channel and see you with the next video bye bye